how was dinner, Martin? <clears throat> Vile. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Did you cook that, or was that... No, no, that, 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 that was cooked by the housekeeper. I didn't know there was one. A house like this it appears to keep itself. Has it always been this vile? Oh, I don't know what you mean about vile. I mean... It feels... It feels like you're inside someone. All those high-vaulted ceilings, they look like jaws to me. Oh, I've lived here since I was a child, old chap, so we're coming back here... I'm and the windows, coming. they look like eyes with styes on them. Old and limey. Oh, and it's the family home, old chap. And the lights, they seem to just come on. I mean, is, is this electric out here? Oh, it's, it's all, always been this way. I'm not quite sure how my great-grandfather set things up, but... Uh, Oh, well, speaking of light, I'll just, I'll just, I'll just turn on this standard lamp. Ow! That is disgusting, Roderick. Oh, because it's in the shape of a gallows, old chap. It is more that it looks, the person it's hanging is long and dangly. Oh, well, my great-grandfather and my great-great-grandfather, they were, well, they did have perhaps an unusual taste. And you, I need to ask you, are you sure about the house's foundations? Foundations? What do you mean? That side, that crack. Oh, there's a, there was a, there's been a thin line all my life, and before that, I understand, and it is the thinnest line. It is perfectly stable, and nothing to worry about. That mirror, it has a look to it. What? I know a little old laws. Ah, I researched them for my stories. That mirror, I would not live so close to it. Oh, it's just an ornamental lake like any other. A little more stagnant, perhaps. But and the shadow comes from it, I tell you. But then I suddenly thought to myself, I said, listen, I'm starting to sound like them. But I thought I'd just check the subsidence. So I went out. And beyond the car, there was the crack. Deep. Deeper than I remembered and darker. And I went back into the house. And it seemed more shadowy. But I turned to Roderick and said, I've had enough of today. I think I'm going to go to bed. And in the morning it might be lighter. And in the morning I shall put you to the first of my stories. No. For I wish your opinion on them. I shall be delighted. 